Yo, back again, part two, same outfit, same episode of episode of football, same episode of football on TV. It's just 30 seconds later. All right. So first, thank you for watching. If you're not subscribed, please subscribe. If you like the videos, like the videos. If you dislike the videos, dislike the videos. All the good stuff, right? Please subscribe. We're almost to the 5,000 subscriber mark. I got this giveaway. Uh, uh, you're going to get the, the brushless motor um, sabers. You're going to get a custom cape, custom everything. It's all your design. Anyway, we got some stuff coming. So part one of this video, we did the clippers. Part two, obviously, after clippers comes the trimmers, right? Again, this year, full of releases. I'm going to go ahead and get my honorable mention out the way because my honorable mention will take me into what I actually like. So, my honorable mention, as y'all can see, still on my station. Well, y'all can't see. I just, y'all don't know where I brought that out from. But, still on my station. If you watch my review on these, I've bought me three of them. Two out of three, still getting the job done. The problem with this is the machine. The machine's not bad, but it's not great, all right? Um, Andes, GTX, the XOs, they gave us the skeleton version of the trimmer that a lot of us are or have been skeleton, putting a skeleton to it for years. Uh, but they did make it cordless, so that's a good thing. They gave us the GTX blade, not a bad trimmer, not a bad blade. It does seem like something was missing from it, though. And it does seem like that power just didn't hit. All right. I love the blade, though. Uh, I actually like the trimmer. I still use it for people with sensitive skin, um, kids sometimes, because it just it's a smooth, fresh out the box. Nice cut, in my opinion. All right. Didn't really care for the sound. Not a bad trimmer, but that leads me into my number three trimmer of the year and like i said you know we the, the company companies have released a lot i'm not gonna name all the clippers that came out this year it was a lot a lot but going from the andis gtxo to my number three clipper of the year brings me to the x evos all right and i may explain why it brings me to them so these are from gamma this gets you 120 minutes of runtime with an hour uh, charge. It comes with the different face plates. You know, Gamma is good for that. Also come with the charging dock. Can't go wrong. Again, if you're going to complain about um, runtime, if you got a charging dock, like y'all tell me all the time, it shouldn't matter. So charging dock, two hours. Two hours on the trimmer, not bad though. All right. So... You get the XO, and here we go. Now, this was 150, I believe, on the website. So for 150, you get the change, the face plates, you get everything that comes with it. The reason I say that these lead me into these is because everybody, a lot of people, and I won't say everybody, but a lot of people say that these did not have a strong enough machine. This machine was perfect, right? It's a great motor. The blade that come on it was not bad, but putting this blade on it just took it to a whole nother level, in my opinion. This is the 50 blends uh, modification. I don't actually know if he have released this yet, but if he have, make sure y'all get it. But anyway, this is my number three trimmer of the year. It had great, I'm going I'm to put videos in from when I had the actual blade that comes on it because the blade was not bad. I'm just a fan of the GTX. So, I mean, the Andes T-Outliners. So that uh, XO blade off of there, putting on this better machine than the, the XO, the Andes machine, and just with a nice blade. So from Gamma, the X Evos, my number three trimmer of the year. Another company that I actually just love, that I feel like a lot of people is, I don't want to say sleeping on, 
I just want to say they're not paying full attention to. And that's who brings me my number two trimmer of the year. And that's Caliber, the 22 Stinger, which if you see my Clippers of the year, boom, same design as the number two Clipper of the year, which comes with the, uh, that's the 50 Cal, the BMG version. All right. This is from Caliber, gives you two hours of run time, hour, uh, and that's kind of the average on the trimmers that's coming out, all right? A few, most of them. Now, my, my number one is going to be, but anyway, this is my number two trimmer of the year, as y'all can see, which again, I'll find a, I'll put a video in here that'll have the sound in it, but... I am putting a new modification, which will put this blade on the 22 Stingers. This is actually an Elite Clipper modification. So we're working with getting that together to make sure it's on there. But all in all, great trimmer, great power. Can't hear nothing. You see it? Woo. Anyway, great trimmer, nice power to it. Can't go wrong. 22 Stinger, number two trimmer of the year. So my number one trimmer of the year actually came in the collection, but by itself, it's the best trimmer of the year. And it's from Babers. And that's why I say the average run time for trimmers are two hours. But as we can see, this beautiful thing give you four hours of run time. Ah, beautiful beautiful and this is the machine four hours of run time very ergonomic is that the word ergonomical i mean the way that it fits even when so when i'm lining people up my thumb just lays right there boom perfect when i'm going down on a bearder going down on a ball head boom perfect blade smooth blade now fresh out the box if you had a chance to use this fresh out the box and you did not try to set it the right way, you was chopping somebody up. You was gonna cut their skin. Luckily, I tapped it on my skin during the review and realized that, ah, not, not good, right? But once you get these set, you dial that blade back just a little bit, this is the most, I mean, the, the width of it, the, the, the slimness of it is great for doing like designs, going around C cups on the lineup, going across the bird i mean it gives you every angle that you can think of and that makes no sense of course it gives you every angle. these will give you every angle but it's just holding it versus a bulkiness not saying that this is just crazy bulky but compared to this it's just slimmer it's nice these are 149 if i'm not mistaken on the website 149 gets you cuts by reggie's ideal trimmer of 2021 <laughs> but <laughs> don't worry about that but all in all this was like the perfect trimmer um it's still on my station again next year i've i've been able to touch some things that's going to give some of these some of some of the stuff that dropped this year run for their money which is great in the grand scheme of things all right but yeah so clippers of trimmers of the year number one number three the gamma x evo number two which can go with your 50 cal bmg you got the 22 stinger and number one from babeless the fx3 trimmer look at that that thing is nice it's beautiful and it got the led look i like the bars i do like the numbers on them. i like like jrl got the timer and stuff i do like these bars though you know what i mean it's cool but all in all those are the clippers if you watch the video if you have not i'll put the card up here or the uh link in the description and um this is the trimmers of the year and cuts by reggie uh and reggie smith in my opinion, 
These are the tools of the year. There's three. I didn't want to give you too many, that's just three. All right? So, if you like the videos, like the videos. If you dislike the videos, there's a thumbs down button just for you. All right? Comment, share, subscribe, and I'll be back. Part three is on the other end, and it'll be dropping tomorrow. Peace.